Hello. Hi, Emily. This is your video. And I'm Madison. <laughs> I really tried to I do hate a creative so intro. Much. I know. Oh. This is our... What video is this? This is our sixth seven, video. Sixth video today. <gasps> it's all for you. Okay, let's get started. Okay. First thing you're going to do. First things first. <sighs> you're going to take your hair... She says your eyebrows. I don't know how many times I have to hear this today. <laughs> I've heard this so many times. And up and around. This section. This section right here. You're going to want to make it even. Ew. I got your hair in it. Ew. Ew. <laughs> Katie failed at life. Always. <laughs> <laughs> Shall I do? <laughs> Christ. We're definitely getting food after this. Uh, yeah. Freaking hungry. Austin, what did you, didn't bring us food? Okay. Freaking didn't bring us any food. Make sure it's even on all sides. Yes. I already said that, Madison. Oh, I didn't. Don't do my job. Uh, well, when, when you graduate. Ha! Ah! Yeah, <laughs> He's gonna be president! <laughs> Who is this again? I got another Emily. Emily. Oh, she's a sweetheart. Isn't she? She's probably laughing. Well, what? not now. But. Your your hair is gonna look so cute because you have bangs. So like your bangs are gonna look so freaking cute with like this. So jealous. So just leave your bangs out. Yes. Well, she can't. How's she gonna pin them up? She can't. She's like a lot of gonna, gel. She's gonna I like understand. pin them and like put body pins all over her head right here. Um. Yeah, that would be pretty hard. That would be really I don't want funny. bangs like. Her. Nah. I don't think I could work it out. She pulls it off so well. No. We're talking about her in her own video. Mm. Mm. Okay. So, first things first. You're going to need a ponytail holder. I don't care what size you use. But get it. No, I'm taking a video. No, nope. ah! definitely taking a video. Hold on. Emily, you're going to be... No, you're not. Oh, dang it. Here we go. Sorry, we're, we've been doing this for so long. Yeah. Okay, so... You're going to get it really, really, really tight to your head. Like, right in the middle. And I don't know if you have one of these... But either a bun maker or you can use a sock bun. I'm going to use a bun maker because I just like them better. So you're going to spread it out like this. Like it's actually like in a bun already. And you're going to take... Why is your hair doing that? I don't know. You're going to... You know what? You could probably just set it there. And you're going to just put the hair up over it. Thank you. Okay, so once you've done that, you're gonna wanna kinda make sure it's the hair's everywhere. And you're gonna take a plastic rubber band. Put my hair all in that. Oh, goodness. I'm getting it to go on. Yeah, I was. That's nasty. Okay. And you're gonna tie it right at the top. So like this, then you're going to make sure all the hairs around it, it's all covered and stuff, and then you're going to push it down on your head, just like that. And the, the buns that you can buy at like Kroger for like $3 come with like stretched out bobby pins. Stop being crazy. So you just kind of stick that into your head. They come with four. So I just do one front, back, and on the side.
never really get bothered with this. Yeah. Okay. So you have that done. Step one is complete. So what you're going to do after you have done this, you're going to separate your little fluff of pear into two. Cooper! Sorry, my dog. Cooper, stop. You're going to braid both sides. Tippy toeing it so hard right now. And I'd use the elastics again. Just tie it. Definitely not, Cooper. Cooper, stop. There's this funky thing. <laughs> you can hairspray that if that happens to you, Emily. Hello. It's my dad. Oh, yeah. Yes, I should probably mention that in the video. She's probably going to think, what's wrong with her? There's nobody there. Hello. <laughs> okay. So once you've finished braiding these, you're going to put it in a little circle like this and pin it into with just like you can just use regular bobby pins. Into the sock button. My dad just go upstairs. Mm -hmm. What? My room is going to be so bad at me. My room is messy too. And she has a little bit of excess stuff under there. So you can just pin that into the actual. The actual bun. And do the same thing. So the other side. There you go. So at the top, it's, you can probably put it a little closer if you wanted to, but it's okay if you don't. It's still cute. And you can kind of fix them to where they're sticking up straight. You can probably pin a, put a body pin in between the two, like right down there, and make that stand up straight. But it's still cute. So after you've done that, what you're going to do is, oh yes, this is fun. I remember now. Where's my tea stain comb? You have it. You're going to part your hair down, down the middle. Down the middle. Okay. So you're going to take this side. You're going to put it. in a mid ponytail like 
that. And then you know, take you're gonna do this either side. I won't do it for you, so it's not like a fifty thousand minute video. But you're gonna take a piece of the hair from the bottom. And you're gonna wrap it around the ponytail holder, and then pin it with a bobby pin. weird that I like the feeling of a bobby pin going through my hair. Well, you're not the most normal person I've ever met, so. Fair I have enough. This, I have this little piece right here. You can just hairspray that down. Madison's got weird hair. hair. It's, it's weird. So, all you're going to do now with this is braid it. And then tie it. And you will do that on the other side, and it will be super, super duper cute. And you'll be good. Yes. Have fun with it. Practice, practice.